Alright guys, Chris with Alabama Salty Adventures here. Out on the beach. This is my first trip out to uh, Var Beach. We're heading out to the reefs about a mile and a half, two miles out. A little bit wavier than I thought it was going to be this morning, but looks like it'll be okay once we get past this break. Anyway, stay tuned and uh, hopefully we'll be reeling in some uh, big snappers. All right, so we're pushing the uh, kayak off the beach here. Uh, first time launching in the surf, so I'm a little nervous. Not sure what to expect. Uh, the waves aren't too bad. They're one foot, one and a half feet tall. So just trying to keep the nose into the surf. Uh, that way it doesn't get the kayak rolled over. Um, timing the waves, trying to figure out when the best time to get in. Figured I'm deep enough to put my drive down that way. As soon as I can uh, jump in the kayak, I'll be able to start pedaling away instead of having to get the paddle out and having more stuff to do. So again, timing the waves, trying to figure out when the best time to get in. Uh, also playing with the depth on how deep I want to be. Um, just, tr just trying to uh, time everything so that way I don't flip over my kayak here. So I think I'm getting it about right. The waves are looking a little bit lower now. They're crashing farther out, giving me time to jump in. And uh, we'll be pushing out here very, very shortly. Alright guys, we uh, been out here for a little bit, got us some bait, some live bait. Now we're heading out to the reefs and uh, hopefully get on something big that I can keep. Or even something big I can't keep, that would be fun to, to reel in. So it's a beautiful morning out here. Waves aren't too bad, it was a little tricky getting out off the beach. But I guess I should have expected that. So we'll see. We got uh, about a mile or so of paddling yet, and we'll be out there. Stay tuned. Come on. What is it? Oh, man. That's a good fighter. Of course, we're not on the uh, strongest. We got some light tackle here with the ugly stick. 3000 Cast King reel. Ooh, what is that? That looks like a grouper. And. Look at there, guys. Yeah, I just caught me a nice red grouper. Too bad they're out of season.
There we go. Is this a red grouper? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Ah. Oh. All right, guys. Huh. Red grouper. Too bad they're out of season. All right. Time for you to go. Bye-bye. Uh, See you, dude. All right. What do we got? Oh, yeah. That's, that's a good one. Oh. Pull and drag. Set that up a little bit. something oh it's big whatever it is Another red grouper. Yeah, he's definitely. He's close. <sighs> it is. Yeah, they are. <laughs> That's true. Or a bobo. Uh. All right, another red grouper. Good fight. Too bad not in this season. All right, dude. See ya. Uh. All right, so after a few red grouper, I finally hooked up into something that was absolutely massive. At least it felt massive. This, I, there were several times I thought it was going to end up pulling me right out of the kayak. One of the guys I was fishing with suggested it might be a, a Goliath grouper, which, yeah, I'm not going to keep it, but that would be really cool to bring up. So we're going to fight it, see what it is. At least give it my all. Well, I'm not seeing any structure by me, so that's good. <laughs> Whew. Whatever it is, it's big. Oh, man. Ugh. 
We are definitely going wherever this fish wants to go, that's for sure. I don't know what this is, but I want to land it just so I can see what it is now. Okay, there we go. Ah, oh, no, he's getting... Is not pulling drag. What in the hell did I hook into? So at this point, been fighting for well over an hour. I was so ungodly tired. I should have listened to the advice earlier and just cut my line. But you know how it is, guys and girls even. You get something set in your mind and you're going to see it through. Come hell or high water. He's getting his uh, third or fourth win now. Good Lord. <sighs> well, he's pulling the kayak at about 1.7 miles an hour. <sighs> Did not plan on catching anything this large. <sighs> Where in the heck are you taking us now? kidding me? Where are you getting this energy from now? Jesus! I don't know if you can see 
son of a bitch has drug me out five miles. <sighs> uh. You have got to be shitting me. 